today is September something. Six. Not enough coffee. We're in southern West Virginia. And uh, it's going to get to about 100 degrees later on today. So we, we started hiking first thing in the morning at first light. Went for about, well, not about, I'll tell you exactly. 2.2 miles. Almost an hour. The sun is already up there. In a tree. This time it actually went, oh, I don't know, they probably went 600 again, 600 yards or so, and then we, could, we kind of lost them over the mountain. Yep. I don't know if they jumped them and chased them or they came up on it in a tree right away, but we just climbed up this mountain. That's why we're all sweaty. And uh, we can hear them barking. Let's go. Find out what, that's the sun right there. Oh, that's Victor, by the way. You'll see him in my future videos. So, well, we'll, we'll get back to you when we get to the tree. So we're in a pickle. But we found this bedding area or a bed. And I'm wondering who stayed here because see this little tree that was broken off? I don't think a deer would break it. What do you all think? It actually smells like it smells like a bear here. Oh yeah. Oh they must have I wonder if they jumped it. Well no, it's too far. Anyway, such a nice little 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 whatever you want to call it, a little cliff in there barking down there somewhere so how are we going to get down oh well Happy birthday. Let's go kill that bear. Hey. Yeah, more steep than Palladium. Yeah, the Palladium is a bit of short show. Let's show from the Palladium. Oops, yeah. Let's go to the other side. 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 Вверх пошел, давай подбегаем сюда, 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 сюда. Давай, 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 давай. Вот сюда, здесь еще, еще, еще. Все. Есть. Разряжай. Хороший размер. Давай, несколько раз сделай, не выспится. 
еще, 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 еще. Все. That's Sever and that's Bucha. Look at that beauty. That's a nice bear. All right, so just a quick update before we start field dressing. It's been, well, it's been like an hour and a half, probably less. It, we just spent 15 minutes looking for a spent casing because those 4570 are not cheap, but we didn't find, did not find it. Anywho, uh, we walked 2.6 miles and uh, actually it's less time, less than that because we started our hike we, I turned this thing on before um, before the actual day, you know, legal hours, and we laced up our boots and whatnot. So we started at well six thirty. Well, but we're talking like six minutes difference. Whatever, don't matter. We got a nice bear. It's Victor's first bear. Very nice hide, even though it's a summer coat. But look at this, look at this head. Look at them teeth. Can we get the tongue in? Come on. Look at that. Look at that guy. Awesome. I gave him some water. So this is our snack. This is that bear from North Carolina last year in the swamp. Bucha, no, uh-uh, no. Ten, forty. All right, we got the meat in the packs. And we got two miles to go to the truck. Let's do it. And then we'll let you know how much weight we got in those bags. It feels like it's quite a quite a lot, but we got it. Sever, come here. So we came out to the gate. Our truck is about know, a quarter mile up that road. So I planned the route to go up and come down, which we did. And we got the bear halfway into the hike. Anyhow, so we're gonna wait for Victor to bring the truck. And then we're gonna weigh all the meat and just see how big of a bear it was. So this is our second day in the West Virginia early season, McDowell County. said that now you know exactly where we are I mean sever come here public land mm. two dogs Just got it done we'll wait well I'll let you know in the end how much the first how much the bear weighs we packed out everything we just left the guts we even brought the liver out um, And that's Sever. This is our second hunt this season, this early season. The first one was with Michael. Um, I'll put a picture up here. We got a nice 
bear, 140 pounds, healthy, good looking bear. Um, I'm exhausted. This is a two mile hike, but the pack is heavy. Well, I'll let you know how heavy it was. Um, last thing I want to add is there's still a couple puppies available. Might be even more. Um, and the reason I say is I didn't collect any deposits from people, so if someone decides to back out, that's fine. Um, I'm not going to hold them to it because if they are not serious about this, because clearly this is a commitment. Hiking is not that difficult, you know, but um, sometimes it gets hot and you got to pack out the meat and you can't really give up. Sever, come here. Don't get close to that road. Come on. So it is a commitment. It's a, so if someone backs out and those puppies become available, that's fine. Because I don't want them like that to have one of my, or two of my puppies. It's just not the right, the right kind of person. <clears throat> need someone who's in charge of their lives. You know, they can arrange for days off and for during the training season, season and during the hunting season. And then during the off season, you gotta be able to go out a couple weeks at, at night chase raccoons, because you gotta, you gotta keep those dogs in shape. I mean, today again, it was what, like 600 yards that they treed the bear from us. Now they ground sent, trailed some of that. In fact, m maybe most of it. And then when they engage the bear, it's treed right away. So, but in order for them to do, to be able to do it, they have to be in their top physical shape. So if you think, if you're one, if you, if you think this is something that you enjoy doing, I mean, this is the second bear and that we harvested, killed. But uh, we treat a whole bunch early in the chase season. I think we're up, well, I don't know. I can, I'll look at the numbers later, but anyhow. So if you think that's something that you wanna do, reach out to me that all the information in this is in the description to this of this video. And um, two dogs is all you need. And we just so happens that we have puppies at home. Uh, both of those dogs are UKC registered. Both were born in, in Russia. I brought them here myself. Um, they're purebred Lycus, West Siberian Lycus. They're clearly getting it done. I mean, what else do you want? Reach out to me and we'll, we'll figure something out. So the totals for today are five hours and five miles. 5.3 and five and a half hours. Now, most of that time we're well, half of that time we're field dressing and skinning and packing, putting away and, and then packing out. So five miles round trip on this trail and we stayed on the trail for the most part. And that's the result. The victory is coming back, should be coming back any second now. And I have a little fish scale. Well, we'll find out the weight just out of curiosity. So we did, we checked the weight. So the total, the bear, we added 15% roughly for the uh, guts and all. And, and ended up being 180, 180 pounds, 180. Um, my pack was 120 pounds. Victor's pack was 60 something. Yeah, 60. But he's doesn't, he doesn't, he's using my, um, the pack that I use for deer hunting, uh, which is, doesn't have a, the external frame, so it doesn't, it's not capable of carrying a lot, but I'm using the external frame and it's, it was not easy, but it's doable. All right, I'm gonna eat and go home. <laughs>